Ladies and gentlemen, today we have finally gone through the entire five weeks of limited gameplay to finally get this Galaxy Opal Power Gasol. This card, I'm very excited to use this card. It has been uh, five weeks of limited to get to this card. We'll go into the main menu, have a look at these stats, and jump into a TTO game. Alright guys, here we are with the 97 overall center power forward Power Gasol from the Los Angeles Lakers. Now, on paper, this card is not actually that good. He's seven foot 250 but we have a look here 93 ball 95 mid range is very nice 85 driving dunk 83 ball handles so he doesn't get those good cheesy ball handles but he's still able to uh still able to dribble quite a bit 84 block 82 perimeter 94 interior defense and 94 for his rebounding he's got an 86 speed and an 84 speed with ball and his lateral quickness is 83 so that's quite good as well his badges he has got 32 hall of fame badges you can see them all here and also an additional 20 23 gold. So on paper, this card isn't fantastic. Um, you definitely can't cheese with him like a Dirk or a Jokic. But for a free card that you only need to play, like pretty much need to play a one game a week for if you're lucky, he is definitely worth it. So we'll jump into a triple throw online game and see how he will match up online. See if we can get all 21 points with his Galaxy Opal Power Gasol. All right, in here we go. This guy's got Gobert, he's got Surge, and he's got Magic Johnson as well. I've got Kevin Durant and Dave. David Robinson joining this Power Gasol as we start the game in horrible fashion here. Going to have to play some defense, try to get that steal there. So we've got Power defending on ball here. You can see his lat's not too bad. He's still, he can still move around a little bit, try to get a steal there if we can. Play on ball in this Magic Johnson. Uh, this Magic card is phenomenal. I absolutely love this Magic Johnson as he gets a bit of a lucky animation there. So we'll try to get the ball in, uh, in Power Gasol's hands here as we get down the court. We'll, we'll try to see what he's like in dribbling real quick. So you can see here... He, you know, he's moving like a, like any cheesy center really would be. He only had that, I think it was an 84 speed or 80 something speed. Uh, you can see that driving dunk as well. He gets, you know, between the legs on triple threat games. He's still going to get those dunks. It's just he, he isn't as, uh, isn't as, uh, he doesn't accelerate as fast as like your Jokic or your Dirk or your Magic cards like that. But he's still definitely, as we go steal with him right there, still definitely a really good card. Um, I've decided I'm not going to try to get all 20, all 21 with him as you can tell. I'm just going to try to test the cards there. A little bit and see how they go, uh, just because you know I'd rather I'd rather try um try have the cards as a part of a team rather than just try and score 21 with them if you know what I mean. So we'll try uh, we'll try get the ball in his hands a little bit more and see how well this Power Gasol can go. Alrighty, on the break here, stop and pop with Power Gasol and that full white gets in there. So he's got five early points here with this Power Gasol. Very very nice. I do like his jump shot. His jump shot's very very smooth. Uh, him and David Robinson are two of my favourites at the centre position at the moment. I have those two. I think Power's my backup uh, backup uh, center at the moment. I might put him into my, my, my powerful position. I'm not too sure as of yet, um, as I turn the ball over again. I'm not too sure as of yet about what I'm going to do with this lineup. Uh, the Power's quite nice, so you can see here, we can dribble with him. He can dish. He doesn't have bullet passer from what I can tell. I don't think he does. I might have to have a look later. Bullet pass is probably like my favorite playmaking badge this year. Um, it is absolutely vital for dishing to the corner and such things, so I really hope that he does have that. So if I do happen to drive with him, I can kick out. We'll try it again here. We'll try a dish to that corner if we need to. Dave, David Robertson is open. I should have iconed that probably. We'll try a reset again here. Try go baseline with him a little bit. Try spin back that way. I see, I see uh, Dave, Dave Robin there, and we get the goaltending call there. This David Robinson card, by the way, I absolutely love this card. By far, my fa like probably my favorite card in the game, besides maybe the KD as well. But like this David Robinson card is so much fun to play around with as he shoots that heavily contested shot there. Powell is running down the wing there in the corner. Stop, pop, and green. That lovely jump shot is absolute butter. I absolutely love it. 16 to 4 start here. I have, I've got how many points are this Powell got. He's got eight so far. So he's got half of the team points. Not too bad. We'll try to get a few more under his belt here. Uh, if, we, if we're if we able to drive here, maybe we'll, we can kick out. Oh, I want to try to get a few more points with him there. That's enough room for Powell. It was a bit of an early catch. We don't manage to get the rebound there. Uh, the rebound there. But I do, I, I really do like this card. We get another steal there with Kevin Durant. We'll run in transition. Powell, that's a little bit deeper that time, but it is also green. This card now has takeover. This, I love this card. Like I, play, I used it once last night at 4am, 5am, 
Um, but the, like, I, I absolutely love this card. I managed to get him first time, actually. I managed to get him um, in our first game last night, as we will end the game there with him as well. So this card is a brilliant, a, a phenomenal catch and shoot center. Absolutely brilliant. We'll jump, actually, I'll, I'll do one more game. We'll do one more game, and uh, I'll see you guys in the second game. Just to give a bit of an idea of what I'm doing with my lineup at the moment, this is my current lineup. Now, I'm thinking about putting Cat at the power forward position, just because he has that high lateral defense, that lateral speed. Uh, where is it down here? He has an 85, so that's pretty good for a 6'11 player. So I will play him at the power forward um, on my lineup. I'm, I will change it around. I just couldn't get rid of the Carl Anthony Towns card. I absolutely love him. So I will have Power Gasol as my backup center. I will start D Rob. You can see here the lineup. I really, really love this starting lineup. The only card I'm probably looking at replacing is probably the Don All, maybe if I got like a Luca or something along those lines, or a Magic. A Magic with Ray, with Clyde, with Kevin, with David. That lineup would be absolutely killer so i can't wait to upgrade that position but I tell you about this clay card if you guys haven't picked up this clay card i highly recommend it it's pro probably the like these three cards here are probably the best catch and shoot cards in the game i swear um but guys we'll jump back into a triple threat online game with this power gasol and see how well he can do again all right here we go coming up against a guy with d rob as well ruthless j90 here he's got power gasol he's got magic and he's got um uh, d rob as well so this guy's got a very similar lineup so we'll see how well we can do here he's already jumping oh okay that, i thought that power was gonna play off a little bit there we'll try to get it oh i thought he was gonna jump then we'll try a driving dunk there beautiful contact that's nearly it, it nearly it never gets blocked that dunk so it's very very good dunk to do um but here we'll defend up magic and see if we can get some more points with this power gasol all right we'll try iso this uh this power gasol a little bit because obviously his speed is higher than his lat so hopefully that means we can blow by the defender maybe uh we'll try a few dribble moves here try get inside the euro into the that is a weird looking dunk but it did manage to go in so that's uh it, it just kind of shows that if you get matched up against the card if you know the stats of the cards and you get matched up against a very similar card you can kind of use the mechanics to get around them a little bit use your knowledge of the speed and the lateral quickness to get around the cards we'll try again here if we can and this guy plays like very good defense it's gonna be very hard to stop this card you can see there this power gasol like, this is power gasol this is a center power forward this is a this is a seven foot um power gasol card so this, this card can move very very well for that sort of height as this guy is driving with magic constantly so we'll try push a little bit more here if we can um, i want to try to get this power to sell as many points as possible uh, we'll call for a screen here we can get some dimes if we have to um, okay we'll try fake back one way see if he switches to power he does switch to power that jump shot is it good enough it is good enough we do wider but we have nine of our nine of all our points here with this power to sell so i'm very very happy with how this card's turning out a bit more power to sell action here here off the catch and shoot he can't make that one it was pretty heavily contested uh, he's got d robin transition that usually goes in he manages to miss that somehow that magic is way too far back there so it does look like with the majority of centers this year like as well as his power gasol he will miss those heavily contested shots which are like some point guards or some small forwards might have go in for them those 30 to 40 percent contested shots but so far like I'm, I'm i'm honestly loving this card you can see there this guy's really loving his jump shot as well it is definitely a good card to have on your lineup. Power Gasol again. That was a bit of a step back move then. A bit of a horrible shot. We'll have to score with this D Rob here. I love D Rob's jump shot. Honestly, it is it is one of the smoothest, easiest to time jump shots in this entire game. So this Power Gasol isn't too different. It's definitely a really smooth jump shot, smooth, quick jump shot. But I really enjoy using that one as well. Great defense from the team there as we push the ball again. Try to get that guy to jump. No, he's not going to, unfortunately. I don't think this guy, I don't think this power gasol has a uh, has any bullet passer unfortunately that's as i said before that's one of my favorite badges this year uh, for a card to have so unfortunately i don't think he has it or he doesn't have it on hall of fame at least uh so that is a bit of a downside to this card but besides this i absolutely love this card power gasol in transition here a bit of a fading shot there a fading 19 percent cover so that shows you like the ability of this card he can still hit those fades he can hit them with a slight contest he's definitely a very good catch and shoot card this year all right we definitely need a stop here. This guy, props to this guy. He's been using the uh, the kick, the, the drive and kick very well this game. We'll try to get a stop against this guy and one more chance at offense. Yeah, what's up? Yo, yo, GG's, mate. Oh, for real? Classic? Nah, I don't know a guy named Classic. Oh, uh, okay, no worries. But I think I've 
I've been on, I've been on like Tekken and and streams like oh, that. Hey, hey, bear, bro. Hey, it's good to meet you, man. Hey, GG's, bro. Have a good night. So, what are the chances of that? Wow, props to that guy for winning. Um, wow, how good's that? I didn't, I did not expect that to come out of that game. Um, I thought he was raging at me at first. I, uh, I went, I, 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 he, he scored, right, and he, he went into game chat, I was like, he's probably abusing me, so I turned on the ga the in-game voice chat, and this guy's saying, yo, GG, I, I recognise your name from someone, wow, okay, that just, I'm very happy with that, sorry, back to the video, though, we will, uh, jump back on the main menu, I'll give you guys my final review on this Power Gasol card, and I'll see you guys there. Alrighty, guys, this Galaxy Airbook Power Gasol, I absolutely love this card, you guys can tell, I did lose that second game, but I absolutely love this card, 93 ball, it is, a, a, it is able to be like you can fade with it you can catch and shoot with it it is a phenomenal card the only downside though i'm gonna have a quick look i don't think he had um from what i could tell i don't think he had bullet passer at any any level unless unless i'm just used to like he might have had it on gold here i, I can't tell pogo blinders bailout needle I, unless I've missed it, yeah, I don't think he has um, a bullet passer at all, which is something I might have to put in this, yeah, he doesn't have it at all, so I might have to put it on this card to make it that little bit better, it is a card that I like to have on all of my plays, if possible, uh, but guys, besides that, this card is absolutely worth it, you can play a minimum of five games across the entire month and, 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 and get this card, it is, it is amazing for a free card, I highly recommend using it, and have a play around with it, see if you like the jump shot, see if you like the speed, 99 offense, 98 defense, see if you like it. Uh, but guys, if you have this card, let me know what your thoughts are down below in the comments, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.